Hey you little sugar babes, Bubble Pop Kids here, get ready. We got your candy bonanza, right now. Oh yeah, like a finally some candy around here on your table, besides a squishy. The little bubble teens, right here on the chopping block. It's my candy testing table today. I have eight different things. We are gonna open them, take a closer look. I even have some exploding pickle candy. <laughs> Pickle candy? Bubble, like, please keep that away from me. Please. Ew, like, what is this bubble? Tall and mighty marshmallow bunny? Like, are you serious? This thing is huge. Looks super tasty. Love the orange and blue. I got this big old tall and mighty bunny. This thing is actually huge. I don't know if the camera's picking up how big it is. It is gigantic. Ooh, it's eight ounces. We get two different colors going. I don't know if they're different flavors. I don't know what it is, but it just looks... Looks too yummy. Oh, you had a gigantic bunny and I see you got some big old lollipop. Like, look at this thing. So amazing. It's huge. Got a big old lollipop. I also have this. I've never seen it before. I just thought it was like the cutest candy in the world. Bonkers Banana. It's actually a candy spray. Look at that. Like strawberry and banana liquid flavor candy spray. Bubble, this thing is super weird. It's super big and it actually looks like a banana. Like it. You guys know I love my little Paw Patrolies. Oh, this is probably the cutest little thing in the bananas. It's like this little bucket, all these little Paw Patrol treats. There's like a lollipop, jelly beans. Can't wait to open that one. So I love my jelly beans. We got a little jelly belly going on. This is such a cute little pink bag smoothie mix. I guess it's gonna taste like smoothie, different flavors. Is it gonna be good? What is this about? Over here in the corner bubble, like what is this? It says the good dinosaur. What? Another super cute thing I saw, I've never seen anything like this. It's like a little chocolate candy surprise egg. Inside there's like a little good dinosaur marshmallow. I mean that is too, that's just too cute. Love it. Who wouldn't love it? Oh, look at that little guy. I love him. I don't remember his name, but like he was so cute. And the final candy are the Jazzles. And the one we're going to be tasting are these little Jazzles. I think this is a British candy for some reason. I have never seen it. It is white chocolate flavored candy buttons with a candy top end. <laughs> so good. Wow, these things are just like too complicated. Like white chocolate candy candy topping. Those are weird. So we got it all right here. We did our little intro. What do you guys say? We open them up. Taste them. Let's do it. Let's do it. I'm ready for some sugar. Let's do it. Oh, like if this doesn't remind me of an Easter basket, I don't know what does. It's like a little mini baby Easter basket. Open it. Oh, if I had to do it, I had to start with this one. Oh, it's so, so adorable. I think it was like $5. I can't even believe all these cutesy little things. I love this little Paw Patrol cup. Check it out. Contains jelly beans, marshmallow, and lollipops. Like, all my favorites. The package is finally opened, and here is that little cup. Oh, it's so cute. I'm gonna put it on my desk, put my little pens and pencils. Got the whole gang going. And tons of sweetie surprises. Look at this, look at this. Like, I don't know why they have to put sidewalk chalk, but I'll take it, because it's cute. Got four little goodies here. Look at this one, so cute. It's like a little sky marshmallow. Feels like a squishy. Bubble, this can double as both. Like you can squish it and eat it. Basically like an edible squishy. Super cute. Look at that face. Sugar coated. Oh, it's too pretty. I don't even want to eat it. I don't want to take a bite. Ooh, it's squishy. It smells good. Take a little taste it. So good. Tastes like a peep. Tastes just like a marshmallow peep. No special flavor. It's okay. Second goodie. Out of the Paw Patrol bucket, we get some lollipops. Blue Rats flavor. I love that it has Sky and Everest. This is beautiful. Let's see what they look like. Whoa. Little blue Paw Printy Pops. Yummy. So good. Mm, nothing too special, but really sweet. Kind of tastes like a blueberry snow cone. So we get a few of those little lollies. And, ooh, look at this. Jelly beans. Jelly beans. Paw Patrol jelly beans. Let's try them. See if it's Paw Patrol colors. Um, yeah, actually they are. They represent each one of the pups. I'll take pink for sky. Mmm. So good. Those jelly beans were excellent. The only thing that didn't taste so great was this. It was just kind of like a plain old marshmallow. Check out this sidewalk chuck. I wish this was edible. 
Yellow. See this thing? I think you ever had any candy bonanza like ever? Let's pass it on up. I'm gonna eat this stuff later. And like, move along. Please. Next up on the table, we got the Bonkers Banana Spray. Oh, this thing is so awesome. Funny thing about this, it's actually the size of a real banana. It looks like a real banana until you flip it. And it's got a little squirter bottle. Well, seriously, how do they think of stuff like this? Like, how do the candy makers think to put a banana peel and, like, make it look like a hairspray bottle candy? Love that. Ew, and look, it's also suitable for, like, vegetarians. So weird. Well, I've popped off the plastic. We got the strawberry banana flavor. I don't know if this is going to be like sour. It's so cool though. Little spritz. Ugh. Oh, you know what this tastes like? It tastes like sour yogurt spray. Like super sweet and sour strawberry banana yogurt. Like totally yogi flavored. Uh, this one was kind of weird. When I first sprayed it, oh, I did not like it. I thought it was like a sour, like a spoiled yogurt. But the more I'm tasting it, Mm, I'm spraying it right there. It's so, so good. Kind of tastes like the Warheads, the sour spray, but not as tangy. It's super sweet though. You got the strawberry, the banana, you got both flavors going. I love it. I <laughs> think I could just drink this thing. Woo! This thing is like amazingly good, too amazingly good for words. It kind of burns my tongue, but like, that's the point. So, loves it. I love how we can keep it in the peel. So there it is guys, the Bonkers Bananas. I actually liked it. It's got such a good taste. Almost, it kind of tastes like a smoothie, like a yogurt. Little candy pick-me-up. I gotta keep this in my purse. Finally, some chocolate round here. Good dinosaur kind. Yummy. I sprayed so much of that banana spray. My tongue is burning, my lips are burning. Ooh, it kind of has a weird tingle to it. So we're moving along to a little chocolate. Candy surprise inside egg. Candy surprise inside egg. Like, that is a super tongue twister. And I do not like that little boy in the movie. He was like the worst. But I loved Dino. Forgot his name. Ew, and that looks like slime. Is there slime in this egg? Bubble. Such a cute box. Such a cute little theme. It's like a little dino egg. Easter milk chocolate egg with marshmallow dino. Oh, so, so cute. Check it out. Ooh. <laughs> it's speckled. Of course it's speckled, like unpeel it and see what's going on with it. Please, chocolate. Whoa. There's our baby. So now my chocolate egg exploded. Half of it's on the floor. At least I got half. But look at this little dino. So, so cute. Oh, his name, I can't remember. It's like at the tip of my tongue. I think it was Arlo. Can't remember, but I love that movie. Look at this little thing. Marshmallowy. Of course it's marshmallowy. It's like a marshmallow peepee -pee kind of dino. Look at his little toenails. Super cute. I'm gonna take a taste. Mm. Mm. Took a little bite of this. Not exactly the yummiest thing, but it was so, so cute. Ah, chewed his head off. Let's try the chocolate. Mm, chocolate was so good. The marshmallow was okay. Let's try to mix them and like, take a bite of both. Let's do it. Mm, yummy. Even better when you eat them both together. It was like a chocolate covered marshmallow. Oh, so good. I kind of wish this little dino was like a toy we could keep because I already ate him. <laughs> so yummy. Yeah, Bubble, like you are the rudest. That was like a little baby cutie dino and you gobbled him up. Like, you gobbled him up like that guy. Whatever. Move along. And this thing just don't make any sense. It's too big. A little good dinosaur to this gigantic pop. Look at this thing. And when I first bought it, I wasn't looking at this paper. I thought it was just like one huge lale. I thought it was a big one, but it's actually 15. 15 tiny pops like inside of this. Now I get it. Let's unwrap this baby, see what we're working with. I don't think this is like a blow pop or a tootsie pop. This is another brand. It's weird. Yeah. Please, oh, let me do it. You're gonna break the whole thing, Bubble. Like, undo the silver twisty and, like, chop the. Just chop it off. There we go. There it is. Looks like a plunger. Mystery solved. There's your pops. They weren't lying when they said that. Here they are. Oh, how cool would it be if this was one big lolly? I guess it's better that they're individually wrapped. You can share them. Ooh, look at all the colors. Try pink. 
Are you joking? Like these pops are ridiculously tiny. They're smaller than like Dum Dum Pops. Yeah. Found one of these. They are super tiny, but you know I gotta taste them. Mmm. Watermelon. See, the pink was watermelon. Like I thought it was gonna be strawberry. So I guess the green is not gonna be watermelon. It's probably like green app. Let me get a taste at it. So tiny. Can't even unwrap. Yeah, green apps for sure. Tastes like a green apple Jolly Rancher. What about the purple? You know it's grape or maybe root beer. Trying to fool us. Let's see. Oh yeah, grape grape grape. Loves it. On to the final. Orange, super boring. I hope it's like mango. You never know. Orange. So I had to do it. I tested out all four flavors and the pink watermelon was my fave. These are not the best lollies, but pretty good. I love this little container. Show nice. It is so nice. Actually, it's because it's like a birthday party or like little piñata fillers. It's really good. Move along. Looks like a lollipop paradise in there. Ooh. Ah. Ooh now this next one. Oh, I've been dreading it. I've been dreading it. It doesn't sound good. But I had to get it so we could look. Exploding pickle candy. Boom, bam, pow. Exploding pickle candy. A blast of dill pickle flavor. Like, look at that. Keep it away from me. I think we got two little packets in here. Oh, ooh, I'm so scared. That just sounds so gross. I think I had a bacon one like this. Ew. Stop being a baby and get it over with and taste the pickle candy like it's gonna explode. Let's see. Ah. Oh, that is just so wrong. That is so wrong. Like, why did they make it? Ew. <laughs> it's actually worse than I thought it was gonna be. Oh, it's just like a Pop Rocks. It's got that Pop Rocks texture. But as soon as it hits your tongue, you taste like a sour pickle juice. It's kind of sweet. Oh, it's gross. I mean, I do like pickles, but not in my candy. Especially not in my Pop Rocks. No way. Oh, these are the most excruciatingly painful candies that we have to taste like ever. They're so disgusting. They're so sour, like pickly. Ew! I just don't know. If you love pickles, I still don't think you're gonna like these things. They just have a really, really bad kick to them. Super soury and not too sweet. Gotta get rid of these. Oh, this is why I love you. From like dark rose, exploding pickle stuff to like tall and mighty, beautiful bunny. Loves you. You know Easter is just around the corner. They're starting to put the candy out a little bit and when I saw this little guy, I went crazy. I had to get it. It is huge. Tall and mighty marshmallow bunny. Look at it. It's blue and orange. And I don't know what kind of flavors we got going, but we got to try it. So yeah, we got to try it. I wish I could like squishy chop it. Kind of looks like a gigantic bunny squishy, but like we're not. We're gonna eat it and like enjoy it. Cause it's candy. Yeah. Wow, this little baby is out of the package. It's bigger than my hands. Oh, it's so good. As soon as it came out of the plastic wrap, the smell hits you. It's like, it almost smells like a Rice Krispie treat. Super buttery, super marshmallowy. It's your big bunny. Oh, have you ever seen a bunny as beautiful as this one? Like orange, blue, and sugar sparkly? Please. I mean, this is Easter bunny candy at like another level. For sure. Get another look at this thing before I take a bite. Wow, look at it. It's like a squishy. It's huge. It smells good. Sugary topping. Mmm. Bubble, I'm gonna eat the whole thing. I'm gonna start with the ears and work down to like the cotton tail. I'm eating this now. So good, you guys. It doesn't have any flavoring, but I don't know why. It's like, it's like a super buttery taste. Tastes like a Rice Krispie treat. Mmm. I'm gonna eat this piece by piece. Mmm. And don't let the blue and orange like fool ya. This is not blueberry and orange flavor. This is like pure marshmallowy, like almost Rice Krispie treat flavor. I'm gonna bend it and like eat it like a sandwich. Mmm. So it's like a Big Mac. Oh, I love it. I'm taking bite after bite. The only thing it's kind of too sugary. They could have made it a little less sweet. Oh, this is too much. Two bites of this and you are done. <laughs> Look at that thing. It's a sugar bomb. I'm taking a sugar bomb. I'm putting it back in like a little sugar bomb thing and like eating this for dinner. Give it to me. Wait, let me see how stretchy it is. Super. A big old marshmallowy bunny. Super sweet. It was like a huge sugar cube. To some jazzles. Jazzles? Like Hannah's jazzles? Who is Hannah? I guess she makes these. White chocolate flavor candy buttons with a candy topping. These are like super complicated. Like I said before. 
These are like the cutest little thing. And I do think these are British candies. I don't know why. Wow, look at them. Little buttons. Two things. Two things, Bubble. I need to give you my critique with like two things. First of all, they don't look like the picture. The picture, they're super bright. These are like super pastel-y. But they don't matter because they're so good and buttery and like crispy goodness. Best candy you ever had, ever. Oh, we have a winner. We have a winner from this whole bonanza. I still got one candy left. These took the prize. They are so super good. They're like this little white chocolate, very thin, but so creamy. Almost tastes like a piece of butter or like a butter cookie. And then it's got all these little sprinkles on there, which give it a crunch. Mm, it just doesn't get better than that. <laughs> jazzles. I gotta get like a ton of these. You don't need to get like a ton of these Jazzles bubble. You need to get like a truckload because I am buying the whole company of Jazzles and like they're making them for me and me only. I need all of them. Candies put the real meaning in like cute as a button. They're cute as a button, but like tastier than a button. So like, figure it out. So good. The last candy pretty much blew my mind. Best taste and sweet ever. I don't know where I'm gonna find those. I gotta get more of them. And we're on to the final. Some Jelly Belly Smoothie Mix. Bubble, I don't know much about this. I do know about Jelly Belly. I don't know about the smoothie mix. But the colors are super beautiful. Like, I know they're gonna be good. These are little teeth. I don't know if they have the different flavors going. Just a smoothie mix. <laughs> Different colors. Don't know. Open it. So I think it's a guide from color to flavor, but like we're gonna figure it out. We're gonna fix it out right now. Just open it. Open it already, Bubble. I'll pop the bag of Jelly Bellies open. Oh, it smells like a smoothie shop in here. So good. First of all, the most beautiful bins I've ever seen like in my life. Look at the colors happening here. Like, you don't get better than this. We get purple speckled. We get orange. We get orange speckled. We get a super neon yellow. Like, what is that flavor? We get pink. Pink speckled. Like, I'm gonna eat these all at once. I'm gonna eat them now. Mmm. Whoa, whoa, whoa. So funny. The final two candies happen to be my favorite. The Jazzies and the Smoothie Beans. They are too good for work. I see why they call them smoothie. They're like creamy and sweet. They kind of taste like, I can't even describe it. Look at that color. All right, Bob, so I'll leave this up to me. I'm figuring this out as I'm tasting. This electric yellow, like one of the most brightest beans in the history of the world, is like a pina colada smoothie. Tastes like pineapple coconut, creamy, for sure. Super good. Let me try this like pink speckled. I'm sure it's gonna be like berry or cherry. Yes, it is. This is gonna be orange Julius, a creamsicle. I know it. Oh yeah, creamy. This crazy speckled one here, like the peachy color with different little pieces. I know that's gonna be peach. I just know it. Peachy. I'm gonna eat all of these. Not only are the colors super, super beautiful, they're beautiful to look at. They are so tasty, and I think my fave is this pina colada. It's so, so good. I'm gonna pick out all the yellow ones. Please, Bubble, don't be so rude. Like, leave some pina colada for me. I love those. Please. And I'm sugared out. I tasted so much of this. I think I ate more candy in this bonanza than any other one. Super good. I love my jazzies the most. Ooh, I have a couple left. They're too good. Pretty much, Bubble, the breakdown of this whole thing is everything was completely delish, except this pickle candy. Like, ew. Keep it away from me. I had a good time with this one. We had a little spray candy. We had lollipops, jelly beans. Fluffy marshmallow. We had a little bit of everything. The only one I just couldn't take was the pickle candy. Ugh. Burnt my tongue. You know what I'm going to do later, Bubble? I'm going to get this banana bunker spray. Spray it on everything and then try it like that. It's going to be good. How do you little squishy teenies? I hope you enjoyed this. I know I did. I am just like going crazy. All this candy. So many good ones. And we are going to have so many more fun ones coming up on the show. And if you want to subscribe to our channel, just click this big yellow bubble with the bubble gum machine and subscribe. Have a great day, you guys. Bye. Actually, I'm doing this as we speak right now. I'm spraying everything down with a banana strawberry spray and then like getting a double helping of it.